draw a bunny rabbit. Boys and girls, we are going to draw some ears on a bunny rabbit, a cotton tail, isn't that cute? And a nose. See its nose? It's like it has a Y there. See this white piece of paper and get yourself a pencil with an eraser on it. I am going to be using my whiteboard and I'm going to be using a black marker so you can see what I'm doing. So let's get started. First, on your white piece of paper, I want you to draw an oval. This is an oval. It kind of looks like an egg, doesn't it? Then over here on the left hand side, you are going to draw a round circle. And this is going to represent the rabbit's head. Then let's go back over to the right hand side. Right about here, we're going to draw another oval. And this is going to be representing the hind leg in a little bit. Now get your eraser and we are going to be doing some erasing. We're going to erase these lines in the inside here. Boys and girls, you use your eraser to erase those inside lines. And I am going to use my uh, tissue paper here. Okay, let's continue. Let's go back to the left hand side and we are going to draw two little round circles right here. That is going to be our rabbit's nose. And let's erase those overlapping lines. Next, we are going to draw two sausage shapes down here at the bottom. And these sausage shapes are going to represent the rabbit's feet. Oops, I need to bring this back further because that's going to meet that back one. Boys and girls, I went and erased the inner line. So look at mine now, erase those lines so it looks like this. You can turn off your video to do that. let's continue to go on right here we're going to put another circle and that is going to be for the foot on the other side and take your eraser I guess I have to use my Kleenex here in the back we're going to put a little tail on our bunny so you're going to make an oval right here. Make it kind of squiggly. It's going to have a little, little fluffy little tail. Then erase the inner lines. What do we find on the top of our bunny rabbit's head? Ears, yes. Yeah. So let's draw some ears. You can draw them short like mine, or you can draw them larger. You can also draw them without the points. You can draw them kind of oval like. Like that. It's up to you. Let's add some lines on the paws for the toes. Good, huh, boys and girls? We can see that those are his toes, huh? Then, for the nose, we're going to draw a Y shape here. Or it 
its nose. See that Y there? And how about an almond shape for the eye? The eye that we can see on this side. Can't see the other side because it's on the other side. So I'm going to use my brown marker. I don't know how this is going to look, but I'm going to color our bunny in. And you can color yours in if you want. Oh my goodness, I don't know. But our little bunny at the beginning of this drawing lesson was tan. So I'm coloring this one in brown. If you have crayons, it'll be better than my markers on this, but you have a good idea what a rabbit looks like from the outline that we have. And now I'm going to show you some amazing rabbits, or if you want to call them, bunnies. Hippity hoppity What's the rabbit's name? Professor. What? Professor. Professor. Here's yeah. Professor. Girl and boy. Baskets full of Easter joy. Things to make your Easter bright and gay. He's got jelly beans for Tommy. Colored eggs for Sister Sue. Get for your mommy and, and an Easter, Easter bonnet too. Oh. Here comes Peter Cottontail. Oh yeah. Hopping down the bunny trail. Here he comes. Hippity hop this baby. He's holding this, this rex. How old is the rex, do you know? He's four months old. Four, oh, a baby holding He's a baby. baby. <laughs> He's a baby. A, a baby, baby holding a baby. A baby. Oh my down God. down the bunny trail. Look at him stop and listen to him say Try to do the things you should mm -hmm. Maybe love, love, love you You roll up Easter eggs your way Oh, I like that! <laughs>